We were supposed to ship out 586 shirts a couple of days ago, but we've had a whole bunch of unavoidable delays that normally happen during this time of the year. You know, during the holidays. Hello. I documented everything in the previous video, but in case you missed it, here's our recap. So the problem that we have right now is that the garments should have been delivered yesterday. 4.27 p.m. Not here yet. 11.22 p.m. It did happen today. Sunday, we had to adapt for equipment for you. They set up the shirt. Raven and Lupita have to go to Austin. I would expect to be here today or tomorrow. The shirts finally came in and we're ready to go. And it's time to hustle up Buttercup. Let's make t-shirts. I wish the whole day went by this smoothly, but Murphy was not in the mood. Plus, if everything went the way we planned it, then this vlog would be boring. But we did have a plan, and it goes like this. Number one, set up the garments. Number two, press like crazy. Number three, pack them up. And finally, number four, ship them out. We try to do all of this while printing out today's DTF orders. Because DTF printing is still fairly new. And the printer manufacturer and the printer and the printer manufacturers are still working out the bug. But I'm getting ahead of myself. If you want to make custom t-shirts or want to be a DTF printer, then this video is for you. Oh boy. Check that out. everyone it is eight in the morning shirts came in last night and we have a long day ahead of us it should be pretty straightforward you know it's a lot of shirts but we should be able to get through them quickly with these two i'm hoping that i can do a like speed test a time trial with the mem presses there we just got those two uh the electric heat press it's with raven they're in austin but they need to upgrade their electrical so that they can keep using it without tripping the breaker but enough talking because it's time to get to work So we survived, <laughs> we survived another day of printing DPS, but a few things happened along the way. Can you hear that? The blade on our inline fan broke, but that's not even the worst part. The worst part is that on the odd leaves, the black ink lines, it came off and all the ink spilled on the floor. I'm gonna show you. See all of that? Yeah. Big mess, big mess. But that's not where the problem is because the rain from this tank went down, spilled over here. Because of all the things that are happening today, my dumb little butt didn't even think that sad things gotta get into the cartridges. And so now they're all contaminated. And this is what the yellow looks like. I don't even see that. I just ordered the parts for it. They're coming in in a few days. But you have these cartridges in the crates for the new printers. What I'm gonna do is I'm going to steal those uh, cartridges, replace that egg light again, and use the parts that I ordered when I set up the new printer. But I'll worry about that later. For now, we gotta ship these out so that we can help Lupita and Raven get through all these garments tonight. Transfers have shipped out, mission accomplished. Gout's acting up again, but gotta do what we gotta do.
now Friday and we still have a whole bunch of shirts to do. But the great thing about Baytown is that the post office is open during the weekends. I have to replace all of these. And I currently don't have any extra cartridges for the ink, so let's get to work. Nobody here? Rave? I'm just gonna wait on Raven and Lupita because they got some KFC. Colonel Sanders right there. All right, a little bit of bad news. We were not able to finish packing the shirts today. As much as we wanted to help out with the pressing, we had to focus our energies on that mess with the printer this morning. We finished pressing most of the shirts. And as you see on the montage, we have some shirts that are shipping out today. But unfortunately, Raven and Lupita have a scheduled dinner that they have to attend tonight. So they're gonna go home, bring the shirts with them, and finish packing and shipping the orders in Austin. business, just as in life, we will face challenges. Some of them will be easy to overcome, while others will test our limits. Sometimes it will seem like nothing can go right and life is working against us, but when this happens, we have to remind ourselves that we have survived 100% of the challenges that have been thrown at us. It took our team a while to get this task done. What started out as a two-day job turned into three, then five, and seven. Through it all, we receive emails from our customers asking where their shirts are. And if you're in e-commerce, you know how stressful that is. Thankfully, once we explain the situation, they understood us and they gave us more time to ship out. When business gets tough and you want to quit, remember this. Life will not give us what we want, but it will give us what we deserve. And it will keep on testing us until it finds out what that is.